The Book of Zechariah Zechariah Chapter 1 In the eighth month of the second year of Darius, the word of the Lord came to the prophet Zechariah, son of Berechiah, the son of Edo. The Lord was very angry with your ancestors. Therefore tell the people this is what the Lord Almighty says. Return to me, declares the Lord Almighty, and I will return to you, says the Lord Almighty. Do not be like your ancestors, to whom the earlier prophets proclaimed, This is what the Lord Almighty says. Turn from your evil ways and your evil practices. But they would not listen or pay attention to me, declares the Lord. Where are your ancestors now? And the prophets, do they live forever? But did not my words and my decrees which I commanded my servants, the prophets, overtake your ancestors? Then they repented and said, The Lord Almighty has done to us what our ways and practices deserve, just as he determined to do. On the twenty-fourth day of the eleventh month, the month of Shebat, in the second year of Darius, the word of the Lord came to the prophet Zechariah, son of Berechiah, the son of Iddo. During the night I had a vision, and there before me was a man mounted on a red horse. He was standing among the myrtle trees in a ravine. Behind him were red, brown, and white horses. I asked, What are these, my lord? The angel who was talking with me answered, I will show you what they are. Then the man standing among the myrtle trees explained, they are the ones the Lord has sent to go throughout the earth. And they reported to the angel of the Lord who was standing among the myrtle trees, We have gone throughout the earth and found the whole earth at rest and in peace. Then the angel of the Lord said, Lord Almighty, how long will you withhold mercy from Jerusalem and from the towns of Judah, which you have been angry with these seventy years? So the Lord spoke kind and comforting words to the angel who talked with me. Then the angel who was speaking to me said, Proclaim this word. This is what the Lord Almighty says. I am very jealous for Jerusalem and Zion, and I am very angry with the nations that feel secure. I was only a little angry, but they went too far with the punishment. Therefore this is what the Lord says. I will return to Jerusalem with mercy, and there my house will be rebuilt, and the measuring line will be stretched out over Jerusalem, declares the Lord Almighty. Proclaim further, this is what the Lord Almighty says, My towns will again overflow with prosperity, and the Lord will again comfort Zion and choose Jerusalem. Then I looked up, and there before me were four horns. I asked the angel who was speaking to me, What are these? He answered me, These are the horns that scattered Judah, Israel, and Jerusalem. Then the Lord showed me four craftsmen. I asked, What are these coming to do? He answered, These are the horns that scattered Judah, so that no one could raise their head. But the craftsmen have come to terrify them, and throw down these horns of the nations, who lifted up their horns against the land of Judah to scatter its people. Zechariah chapter 2 Then I looked up, and there before me was a man with a measuring line in his hand. I asked, Where are you going? He answered me, To measure Jerusalem, to find out how wide and how long it is. While the angel who was speaking to me was leaving, another angel came to meet him and said to him, Run! Tell that young man, Jerusalem will be a city without walls, because of the great number of people and animals in it, and I myself will be a wall of fire around it, declares the Lord, and I will be its glory within. Come, come, flee from the land of the north, declares the Lord, for I have scattered you to the four winds of heaven, declares the Lord. Come, Zion. Escape you who live in daughter Babylon. For this is what the Lord Almighty says. After the glorious one has sent me against the nations that have plundered you, for whoever touches you touches the apple of his eye, I will surely raise my hand against them, so that their slaves will plunder them.
Then you will know that the Lord Almighty has sent me. Shout and be glad, daughter Zion, for I am coming, and I will live among you, declares the Lord. Many nations will be joined with the Lord in that day, and will become my people. I will live among you, and you will know that the Lord Almighty has sent me to you. The Lord will inherit Judah as his portion in the Holy Land, and will again choose Jerusalem. Be still before the Lord, all mankind, because he has roused himself from his holy dwelling.